Hey everyone, my name's Sam, and I'm at New York City Comic Con 2014, where new characters and costumes have inspired new cosplay. Let's check them out. These cosplayers didn't just look the part, but stopped to talk to us about what it takes to get into character. What made you decide to go as uh, this rendition of Miss Marvel? Oh, I love this rendition. Kamala Khan is a beautiful storyline, and it's great to have more people of color that women can relate to, especially, I mean, I'm not as young as her, but I do love their storyline, and I mean, I love fan fiction and nerding out a lot, as you can see. What did you think when you saw that outfit that you needed to cosplay this as opposed to any other rendition of that girl? It's really nice, like the jacket and the pants itself is two-piece. So I felt like it's something that um, you can wear out on the streets and it's really easy to move around with. So I definitely think it's such a great costume to wear. What do you say to those who might say that Hawkeye pulls off purple better? Oh, uh, I would say that girl does it even better. <laughs> Comic-Con takes place in the Javits Center in the heart of Manhattan. We understand that Hawkeye had to travel the whole way from Brooklyn. Was that a good trip for you? No, it's raining in the subway to close. Just in time for Halloween, my favorite witch, I have to ask, in that tome of yours, is there one spell that you would cast on Comic-Con right now? I would cast a spell on all the people to get out of my way. <laughs> now, I hear Xena, Warrior Princess, has quite the war cry that might eight foot radius. Yeah, I think that's all right. But can we put that to the test? I'm Bump, and I'm Bang. And you guys enjoying Comic-Con today? Oh, it's fantastic. We love Comic-Con, yeah. Do you have a favorite part about Comic-Con? Oh, I love the cosplay. Yeah, I, I like being interviewed by pretty girls. Oh, thank <laughs> you. For the camera, can you give us like a cowabunga dude? <laughs> okay. Right. Cowabunga dude. So whether you come from the Golden Age or are still a young Avenger, you're sure to find a costume that suits you. And with new comics and characters coming out every week, I can't wait to see what's in store for New York Comic Con 2015.